Thanks for joining. Let's open up this box from NGC. See how it goes. Opening the box. Here we go. <clears throat> yep, it's 10 coins. It's gonna be quick. Uh, I do know for sure though, two of the 10 are gonna be those 1965 SMS Kennedys, those those two that were, or remember how I found the four that were black and white? Sent two to NGC, two to PCGS. Well, let's just say that NGC got it right and the other grading service didn't, so I had to crack them out and send the other two to NGC. So I'm pretty excited to see what happened here. The first one, the 1970D. 1970D, Blast White. Um, all these Kennedys that I find in cement, I find these in mint sets and proof sets and whatnot, so uh, a 1970D and MS66 is a great, great coin. Uh, it's been a while since I uh, focused on making any, but last time, I mean, they were in the 250 to 350 range, or maybe like 300, if I remember right. Um, here's the, the second 1970D. It graded uh, MS65. It's not a six, but I'll take it. All right, number three. Another 1970D MS66. So, uh, perfect, awesome. Sent four 1970Ds total. Um, here's the fourth one, 1970D, it graded MS65. So, on those 70Ds, you know, I'm pretty sure uh, paying anywhere from, I don't remember if it's eight or $12 a piece, 14 maybe for those 1970D mint sets, or excuse me, 1970 mint sets. And so, 65s are like $50 coins, so you're basically breaking even on those, and you're making your money on the sixes. Pretty common, pretty typical in this business. Ooh, ooh, I'm excited to share this one with you guys. Check it out. Check out that black and white beauty. MS67 Plus Ultra Cam. Pretty funny how it, co how it goes to uh, one grading company and grades a 67 cam, and the other grading company is gonna go ahead and see it for what it is and call it a 67 ultra cam. Um, that's what's exciting about this business. This coin, let's say I didn't know Kennedy's and I, I just either got it graded or you know was able to find it at a show in that other holder as a 67 cameo. That's gonna be like a mm, 250 to $350 coin. Same coin in this holder same coin in this holder, you guys, that's easily a $4,000 coin. Um, I might even be able to get five out of it with the plus. I'm gonna go for five. Uh, I've seen just very, very few of those black and white 1965 SMS Kennedys. Here's the second one. And this one came back MS67 Ultra Cameo. As you can see, black and white. The other grading company, I hate to say it, the other one, they called this a 66 Cameo. $100 coin. It's just the goofiest thing in the, in the world. You got a $100 coin, or you got a $3,000 coin, which one would you pick? Well, if you were selling them. Obviously, if you were buying them, you're gonna buy the $100 coin, but when you're selling them, you're gonna sell it in the $3,000 holder. So, I don't know how well this is gonna be able to pick up. I'm gonna try to get a close up somehow. This is just a 1961 Proof Franklin. It's very basic, it's very generic, but I noticed when I was opening it up, uh, in fact, you can see it there on the forehead. It's got a really nice strike through. I don't recall ever finding a, a Proof Franklin with that degree of a strike through. Have no idea what that could have came from. Um, if anybody that watches this feels like you kind of have an idea as to where that could have came from, please let me know because I, I would like to know. But it's it's deep, it's like a crater. It's like a crater right in his brain. 
just a just a clean Franklin with that strike through. So you guys, one thing I found with NGC, and I really like this about them and appreciate this about them. So on this um, 1961 Franklin, it's such a big strike through, the graders are not gonna miss that. And so I don't send this under the air tier. I, I, I don't submit this uh, as an error. I just submit it regular, submit it normal, pay the normal price. Um, and then they go ahead and, and they put obverse struck through on the label. So thanks for doing that NGC. It's one, one of the benefits there. Okay, here's another 1961 Proof Franklin. And this one came back 67 Cameo, which I, I feel is pretty accurate. Um, just a good looking coin. That's why I sent it. Ooh, this is going to be a nice one for Toner Tuesday. If I can even capture that color, yeah, I'm not going to be able to. Alright, maybe you can see the color a little bit better here. It's also deep cameo, in my opinion. But uh, the color, oh man, it's going to be tough to see, but that color is just amazing, you guys. Absolute beauty. It came in a proof set. Uh, I opened it myself. One of those blue box proof sets. Um, I actually posted a few of the of the toned scents that came in those same proof sets. And yeah, you just you just can't see it in the video, but it's just real nice orange to purple crescent crescent toning just a beautiful coin so um, the other grading company uh, they gave a QC once maybe twice and then I seen it NGC where it graded so this coin's pretty cool you guys this is a 1960 proof Franklin uh, it's black and white essentially and I don't know what the deal was on this coin but it's one of the first coins I bought raw from Instagram and I bought it I mean, I paid up. I paid good money for this coin raw uh, because to me it looked deep cam and uh, it took a few trips to the graders, but we finally got it in a 68 Ultra Cameo holder, uh, which is a really good grade for this 1960 Proof Franklin and it deserves it. So, all right, that's it. That's all we got for tonight. That's our 10 coin submission. Yeah. Good news is that uh, I'm just about ready to jump back full force into the coin game. Um, we're going to be adding some exciting things. Uh, I think I'm going to kind of dive into the sports card arena and start learning that. Uh, thanks again for joining us, and we'll see you guys next time.